also hoping to earn a spot in the Elite Eight tonight. Lincoln Christian just a win away from the state tournament. For more on that, we turn to Ryan Mix, who's live in the newsroom. Hey, Ryan. Hey, Adam, that's right. Lincoln Christian had a really tough matchup ahead, ahead of them tonight. Falls City 23-2 and coming into tonight's matchup. Their only in-state loss on the year was back in December to Class B Plattsmouth. So Lincoln Christian trying to change the script tonight in the first quarter. The Crusaders, Logan Power goes to work. Hoop and the harm. Crusaders lead 11-10 after one quarter. Right before the end of the half. Safest. Crucial bucket here for Fall City. Weston Witt hits the three. And Lincoln Christian gets one last chance. Their heave is no good. Fall City only had five points in the second quarter, but they trail by three at half. Now in the third quarter, Ryan Mount gets the bucket down low. Tigers have their biggest lead of the game at four. Four quarter, under three minutes to go. Evan Mathers hits a huge three for Lincoln Christian. <laughs> the Crusaders go up one, going down the wire. Fall City down one. Mitch Harling splits the defense, gets the runner to fall. Tigers take a one-point lead. 7.2 seconds to go. Last chance for Lincoln Christian. Power gets double teamed. Lake Shaquin, three ball, no good. And Fall City advances to the state tournament heartbreak city for lincoln christian Brother so the tigers advance to pinnacle bank arena if their fan base travels to lincoln like it did tonight at nebraska city it'll be a boisterous crowd at pba for fall city now there were six district finals tonight so lincoln christian still has an outside shot at earning a wild card burst adam we'll oh, toss really? it back to you